Hey everyone, welcome back. In today's video, I'm going to show you step by step how to clone and run a Laravel 12 project directly from GitHub. If you're just getting started with Laravel or you've downloaded an admin template and want to set it up on your local machine, this guide will make it super simple. Let's dive right in. First, open your terminal, go to your project folder, just type cd followed by your desired path and then paste the git clone command. This will download the Laravel admin template directly to your local machine. Once the download is finished, open your project folder using Finder or File Explorer and then open it with VS Code. Step 2. Install PHP dependencies. Open the integrated terminal in VS Code and type Composer install. This command will download all the necessary Laravel packages and dependencies your project needs to run properly. Now let's set up the environment file for our Laravel project. In the terminal, type cp.env.example.env. This command makes a copy of the example environment file and names it .env. Next, run pprtsendkey generate to create a unique application key for your project. After that, open the .env file and update your database configuration like your database name, username, and password to match your local setup. If you see a message that says the database Laravel admin template does not exist on the MySQL connection, would you like to create it? Just select yes and press enter. Laravel will automatically create the database for you and then run all the migration successfully. Now let's install the node dependencies and build the front-end assets for our Laravel project. In the terminal, type npm install. This command will download all the required JavaScript and CSS packages used in the template. Once that's done, run npm run dev to compile the assets for development mode. If you're preparing the project for production, you can instead run npm run build. After the build finishes, all your front-end files like CSS and JavaScript will be ready to use. Next, we need to create a symbolic link between the storage folder and the public directory so uploaded files can be accessed properly. In your terminal, run the command pp-artisan-storage-link. Laravel will create the link automatically and you should see a message saying the public storage directory has been linked. All right, we're on the final step. To run the Laravel application, simply type pp artisan serve in your terminal. This will start the local development server. Once it's running, open your browser and go to http 1127.0.0.18000. And that's it. Your Laravel 12 admin template is now up and running. Now, when you open the project in your browser, you'll see the login page. Here, just enter your email and password or use the default credentials if they're already set up and then click sign in. That confirms the sign up process is working correctly and your data is safely stored in the database. Now that we're logged in, let's explore the admin dashboard. Here you can see a clean and modern interface built with Laravel 12 and Bootstrap. You can easily navigate through the menus, manage data and customize the layout to fit your project needs. Next, let's click the calendar icon on the top navbar. When you click it, you'll see a small drop down showing the current date or upcoming events depending on how the feature is set up. Now let's click on the to-do list option from the menu. This helps you stay organized and manage your tasks easily. Next, click on the chat option. Here, you can start conversations, send messages and stay connected with other users right inside the dashboard. You can choose between light, dark, or system mode to match your preference. Next, you'll notice multiple flags on the top bar. Up here, you'll see the message alert icon. When new messages arrive, it shows a notification badge. On the top right, you'll see the profile dropdown. When you click it, it shows your profile image, name, and email. Inside the account settings, you'll see several tabs for managing your profile details. It's all organized in one place, making it easy to manage your account. This is the login screen. Here users can enter their email and password to access the dashboard. From here, you can quickly access your account settings or log out. This will securely sign you out and take you back to the login screen. Notice that when you click a tab in the sidebar or nav bar, the page automatically scrolls back to the top. Over here, we have the template customizer. 
Here you can switch between light and dark modes or choose a different layout style. Next, under navigation position, you can choose how the main menu appears in your app. This applies a darker style to the sidebar and header while keeping the main content area light. Next, under layout style, you can choose how your app's layout is displayed. Select LTR for left to right languages like English or RTL for right to left languages like Arabic. The dashboard updates instantly to match your selected direction. Next, under navbar type, you can choose how the top navigation bar behaves. Choose sticky to keep it on top, floating for a raised look, or static to keep it fixed in place. Each option gives your layout a different feel and user experience. Next, we have the router transition setting. Here, you can choose how the main content animates when switching between pages like fade, slide, or zoom in. It adds a nice touch of motion to your app's navigation. On the left sidebar, you can see the main menu. It includes sections like dashboard, sales, analytics, finance, and crypto. On the left sidebar, you can find analytics under the sales menu. When you open it, you'll see a clean, modern layout designed to help you track key performance metrics at a glance. From the left sidebar, simply click on finance and you'll see a clean and modern page designed to help you track all financial activities in one place. From the sidebar, go down and click on crypto. This section is designed for tracking digital assets and market performance in real time. We have chat, a real-time messaging tool for quick communication between users. Then there's mailbox, perfect for handling emails directly inside the dashboard. From the sidebar, open apps, chat, and you'll see a clean modern interface built for real-time communication. In the main area, we have the chat window where messages appear with clear timestamps, avatars, and smooth message bubbles. From the sidebar, open apps, mailbox, and you'll see a professional, clean interface designed for managing your emails directly from the dashboard. It's perfect for managing your messages efficiently all within your dashboard environment. From the sidebar, open apps, to-do list, and you'll see a simple and organized layout designed to help you manage daily tasks easily. This app is perfect for personal task tracking, project management, or team workflows, helping you stay productive right inside the dashboard. You can easily mark tasks as completed, edit them, or delete when finished, keeping your list clean and up to date. From the sidebar, open apps, notes, and you'll find a clean and minimal interface designed for quickly capturing ideas, reminders, or project details. At the top, there's a new note button. Simply click it to create a note with the title and content area. Each note is displayed as a colorful card, making it easy to organize your thoughts visually. You can also edit, pin, or delete notes anytime with just a click, and pinned notes always stay at the top for quick access. The layout uses soft colors and smooth animations, giving it a modern and clutter-free look that fits perfectly with the rest of the dashboard. From the sidebar, open apps, scrum board, and you'll see a modern drag and drop interface designed for project and task management. The board is divided into columns like to do, in progress, and done, helping you visualize the entire workflow. Each task card shows a title, priority, due date, and even assigned team members. You can easily drag tasks from one column to another as progress updates. It's smooth, intuitive, and keeps your projects on track. The layout is fully responsive with soft shadows and a clean structure that matches the overall dashboard design. This app is perfect for teams and developers who follow Agile or Scrum methodology, giving a clear view of progress in real time. From the sidebar, open apps, contacts, and you'll see a clean and organized layout designed for managing user or client information efficiently. At the top, there's a search bar that helps you quickly find any contact by name, email, or phone number. The main area displays a contact list or grid view showing each person's profile picture, name, position, and contact details. You can easily add new contacts, edit existing ones, or delete entries with just a few clicks. Each contact card is neatly designed with a modern UI, rounded corners, soft shadows, and hover effects for a smooth user experience. From the sidebar, open apps, 
invoice and you'll find a professional modern interface made for managing your business invoices with ease. On the main page, we have the invoice list displaying all invoices with details like invoice ID, client name, date, status, and total amount. You can easily filter, sort, or search invoices using the top toolbar. At the top right, there's a create invoice button. When you click it, you'll be taken to the add invoice page where you can fill in all the details like client information, item description, quantity, price, and tax. You can also edit any invoice by clicking the edit icon, make quick updates, and save changes instantly. From the sidebar, open apps calendar and you'll see a clean and interactive scheduling interface designed to help you stay organized and manage your time effectively. At the top, you can switch between different views like month, weekday, or agenda to see your events the way you prefer. Adding a new event is simple. Just click on a date or time slot, enter the event title, description, and duration, and hit save. You can also edit or delete events anytime with a single click. Each event is color-coded for easy identification, for example, meetings, deadlines, or personal reminders. This calendar app is perfect for tracking tasks, meetings, and project schedules, keeping your workflow organized right inside your dashboard. From the sidebar or top navigation, open profile, and you'll see a modern, well-structured layout that displays all user information in one place. At the top, we have the user cover area with the profile picture, name, and role giving a clean and professional header design. The Laravel project structure, especially for your dashboard project. When you open your Laravel project, you'll see folders like these in the root directory. This is the heart of your Laravel application. It contains most of your code. This is the entry point of your app where the browser loads your site. It contains, this folder contains all front-end files and blade templates. All right, that's a complete walkthrough of our Laravel admin template. Thanks for watching. I'm Starcode Carl, and I'll see you in the next tutorial.